hello guys in today's video you are learning how to design this beautiful birthday flyer here yes i did this with my smartphone and please watch this video from very start to the end thank you This is another tutorial and I welcome you all to Jack's graphic channel. So if you are new here, my name is Jax and onto my channel I teach people how to design a stunting graphic design using their smartphone. Yes, and this design you see I did this with my smartphone with an application called what Pixel Lab and without saying much, I will actually be showing you all the steps I took to arrive at this beautiful result here so if truly you love stuff like this please i'm begging you don't leave this channel without subscribing when you subscribe you turn on your notification sign please subscribe and turn on your notification sign and the reason for you to do that is to always get notified whenever i drop a new video yes and without wasting much of your time guys i know sabi talk too much my chapali take you guys to pixel lab and show you how i did this so now this is my pixel lab application you see that then from here let me take it up you delete this so after you've deleted this now click on your plus sign anytime you want to import anything on pixel lab that's the plus sign is the work when you click on your plus sign it will take you straight to your phone gallery then once you get to this phone gallery from here you now select the background you will be working with so this is the background i will be working with now so I will first use this background, you rotate, you click your good sign, then expand this background to fit to your working area on Pixel Lab. Do you see how this looks like? Just expand, make it fit here. Good. Then after this, you lock it up. Then click on your plus sign again to import another one. Good. Now the next one I will be importing now is this. The next one I will be importing now is actually this you see that so when you bring in this you click here now you increase this make it fit again like you did to the first background so once this stuff is here reduce a little bit so once this stuff is here guy I beg at the verse for now kindly subscribe if you've not subscribed please subscribe turn on notification sign so you don't miss videos like this so this is what we are having then after this now come here go to opaque city just to reduce this because i want the first background to equally be showing do you understand so this is what you will be having you see that then after this now just reduce it a little more good then after this lock it up then after you've locked it up now, good. Now let's start the designing. This I still need to like bring one more grab this thing here. So when you click here, bring another background here. But really don't panic because all the resources I used on this video, I will link them to this video description. So you are not just learning this, you are actually getting free resources too from Jax. So do not panic. Then I used this you see that so when you bring this in now uh, you increase this this is what you will be getting now go to opacity again reduce the opacity of this so when you reduce the opacity this is what you will actually be getting cool then after that you lock this up so this is what we are having now let me bring in the picture of the celebrant like the person celebrating the birthday so this is the girl you click on this picture first rotate it if you want to rotate, you use all this angle. That's the work of the angles. So you rotate to this side. You have this. You reduce this. You bring it here. Then you copy. Go to crop. Make it face the opposite side. Cool. Then you reduce this. One must be smaller than the other gets big. Hope you grab the logic. So this is what you are having. You lock the two up. So after you lock the two up, now you group the two together, make it become one object. So when you click here, you click the two video, the two pictures, then you, sorry, 
then you click here and here we go it has become one now you see that so you reduce this bring it here and uh, please please don't be offended with that um, machine horn actually life here in, in Anambra especially here is very noisy so I'm sorry for that then after this now you place this stuff here then after you place this off here now look at what I'll be doing I want to do a gradient color like a grounded effect on this picture to cover the edges of that picture so this is what you will do now you come to your typing bar which is here so when you come to your typing bar now you bring in your bet this is your bet bet day but I will be writing only bet so when you bring in your bet you move it here you increase this bet make it cover the right up do you see that increase a little more so once it has covered this right up now go to your font go to font now you select the font you'll be using so i will be using this font for this work don't worry everything i will just link it to the video description so all i need you to do is to watch this video pay attention watch from start to finish you get so you don't miss anything if you want to make money as a graphic designer all these steps i'm taking is what you need to put in mind so you can actually design a very good graphic work for your client or for yourself or if you want to make massive cards as a graphic designer so you need to master all these principles that i'm doing so once you bring this stuff here you see how this looks like cool now go to outline and uh, sorry shadow enable the shadow then enable it here like make the shadow to be big you see that so you increase this you reduce this later you increase this so this so this is what you will be having here cool then after this now okay so after this now you lock this up now come to this you bring this stuff here you see what i'm doing when you bring it here now go to color enable your color so i'll be using a normal yellow color so when you bring in your normal yellow color you see what you are having cool then you go to outline that stroke enable your stroke give it a white stroke good then after this go to inner shadow enable your inner shadow okay when you enable your inner shadow you have something like this cool now good sorry that's shadow then coming to your inner shadow enable your inner shadow this is what we are having so you increase this little bit this is what we are having now try to like rotate it the other side this it has changed the step but this is actually what i did cool then just take it to the other side you will see the effect so do you see how that looks like so this is actually how i did the the writing stuff this is how that looks like you love it right please please i'm begging you i know you love it at this point so please subscribe to my channel so you won't miss much of something like this thank you then after this now very easy next thing to do now is just click on this you copy click on this then you bring this enable now that bed day that you did not finish now you have to put the day below here you see what i'm doing cool so you reduce this day place it somewhere here enable it to you place your day here you see that cool then after this this bed you copy the bed then you change it to what day which is this and this is what you are having you bring this stuff here now that's the first the second the one on top you reduce it you make it fit here very well do you understand so this is what you will be having if you should do that so you make it fit very very well here so this is what we'll be having do you see how that looks like you love it right cool then after that now look at what we'll be doing now join the two day this this and this together do you see that then you join them together it has become one object so you take it up you now reduce it place it the exact place you want it to be make it be at the center you see that so this is cool isn't it 
perfect then after that you lock this up then after this now go to your gallery then when you go to your gallery there is a bloom blue stuff that there is a balloon stuff at the background so let me just bring it let me bring the balloon sign so let's go let's go let's go for the hunting let's go for the hunting guys let's go for the hunting please at this point i guess you are missing something subscribe to my channel i'm begging you please subscribe to my channel turn on your notification sign it is very 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 important yes very very important so i'm still hunting for that balloon i am hunting for the balloon so follow me as i the search for the balloon i beg no go out to watch them from start to the end yes very very important okay locating the balloon still searching for the balloon aha i've gotten it so this is the balloon you see that cool i see no point you cropping okay but let me just do the cropping since i'm only using the balloon so this is what you will have you rotate you bring this balloon here copy again you rotate bring the other balloon here but this time i had got to reduce this balloon then make it pop out like you make it pop out you see how this looks like now oh i've made a mistake yes i've made a very big mistake so this is what you will do take this balloon to the back then take this balloon to the back this okay it can still work so this pops up a little bit then this pops out little bit so this is how this looks like this is cool right okay i think i need to like move it okay first reduce this bring it here okay this is cool then this take it in perfect so this is what we are having then after that you lock it up so after you've locked this up now what's the next thing okay so after this now you bring your glorious birthday this is a mistake so go to your typing bring in what glorious this is glorious birthday you bring this down here so when you take it down now you go to alignment spacing alignment you use your spacing alignment you place this stuff here then after that go to font so let's locate our font this is font so when you locate your font you use this fantony font here then after you use the fantony then go to shadow enable your shadow so that it can be readable like you we know that something is there that's actually why i bought in that stuff there so when you place this here this here that looks like glorious cool then after that go to your shapes bring in shapes then reduce this shape place it here reduce it make it align with this so this is what we are having right then good after this now reduce little bit now use your position to just drag it down little this is cool then after this next thing you need to write now is the name of the celebrant which is what ella so you bring ella in Cool. then once you bring the Ella drag the Ella inside here and drag this Ella inside here so when you bring in the Ella go to color use the same color you use at the background you use the same color then go to size increase the size so when you increase the size Use your position to, to make that be at the center of that shape that you provided there. You see that? Cool. Then after this now, go to your font. I use the stylish font there. So when you go to your font, this is not the font that I use. Shake the font, not this. So this is the font that I use. You see that? Then after that, go to style. Enable that. Do you see what we are having? So after that now, go to your position to 
take it down then when you bring it down go to size like make it big then use your position make it fit well in the shape so this is what we are having as our Ella cool then after this now next thing to do is to bring in your wish for her yes rejoice aloud so let me write it down rejoice aloud for your new age is what is blessed cool then this reduce remember graphic design is all about what arrangement so you bring this down as you can see now the tricks i'm using is all my tests is not passing this birthday to the end of age you see that then after this go to font locate your font then use monstera so this is cool right you love it perfect then after this now i'm using the same font so all you need to do is just to copy then when you copy click here you bring in the date see zero eight two three then after this now use your position to place it here by the side then after this just increase it a little bit so this is cool right then after this copy again when you copy then double click here you bring in what bet code so that people will know that what you pen down here is actually the birthday date of this girl so place this bring it by the side here now you reduce this now use your size that's your size here to reduce it make it be on the same line with the birthday with the code rather so take it you see how that looks like take it off by the side take it off so i think this is cool you see how that looks like perfect then after that now next thing i need to bring is this but before that let me lock everything up so i don't mistakenly move any of them cool then after this now next thing to bring is what the blow gift so go to your gallery let me locate the blow gift and at this point please i'm back so we are looking for the blow gift now to just twist it up or to spice our graphic design up so so this is it you see that so when you click on this you click here now you bring this stuff reduce it like rotate it because i don't need the other part i just want little of it to show something like this is cool you see that so when you click here come here you copy this go the other side you rotate it again just bring it somewhere here you see how this looks like this is cool right then after this lock the two up you see that then after you've locked it up now you bring i'm um, actually this design was made by jack so i see no point putting okay let me put it so you click here that's design designed by jack's graphic then you put my number 08142375203 375203 this is it you reduce the ease then rotate it place it by the side here is actually okay for it you see how that goes then after this has been placed here perfect now next thing you need to do is this there is actually another gift icon that i placed under here so you go to your gallery when you go to your gallery locate the gift yeah, let me locate the gift. You see that? So once you click on this gift, it's here. You click this. Perfect. Now you drag this gift stuff here. Just little. Take this off. You bring this gift stuff somewhere here. So can you see within? 20 minutes within less than 20 minutes we are done with this amazing design so please 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 i'm begging you 
subscribe to my channel turn on your notification sign subscribe and turn on your notification sign so you don't miss amazing videos like this and i strongly believe you learned something from this video thank you for watching this great length and catch you guys on my next video thanks and bye bye for now